Hi everyone, it's Andrea with the Hippie Art Studio today, bringing you another vlog. Um, it's another typical Saturday, everybody's asleep, I'm going to be doing some recording today, and I just thought I'd pop on and kind of show you what I've been up to. <coughs> Excuse me, I've been sick. <coughs> For just a little bit. Um, I have been playing with some PBO paint and it's pretty darn cool. I made this one, the window's right there, so it's gonna kind of really shimmer. I made this one a couple weeks ago when I first got them. And there will be a video coming up soon about this guy. And like I said, I literally brought them home, played with them. So I didn't know a whole lot about them. And since then, I've learned a little bit more. And I did, this one's still wet, but I did this one last night. In the wee hours of the morning. So there's no video on this because my lighting is not, is not good at night. We're still working on that part. Nighttime indoor lighting. So, I have prepped. Oops, move the camera. Sorry, guys. I have prepped some wood panels that I got at Michael's with just some gesso and some texture. It's iridescent medium. I don't know if it's going to pick up very well. And I'm going to try playing with the PBO paint on those today. And see how that works out. I'm going to move the camera again, sorry. That's just where they were sitting. Also, I am going to be working on December Daily. My two... Two... My two books... Um, my one from 2013 and my one from 2014. My original goal was to get those done for October so I can have November to set up the 2015 album, but considering it's halfway through October and I just literally found both of them, I don't know if that'll happen or not. We'll see. <laughs> so... Here is those two books. No supplies in this box, just the two books. This is the one from 2014. Just give you a quick peek. There will be a flip coming for that guy here shortly. I'm almost caught up with editing videos. I'm hoping to finish that this weekend so that I can move on to some new ones. And then this beast is my 2013 album, which I need to do some kind of cover because I found this in a box because we're still unpacking for moving and it didn't hold up very well. There's some torn page protectors and things like that, but I'll give you a little peek inside that. And again, there will be a video flip of that here shortly. I also have been working on my journaling by fives in my phone book. So I've done session one. I need to do session two. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do for session two. I'm excited. So I've got that going on. Lots going on, obviously. Um, I'm really bad about that. And what else do we have? Journaling my fives, PBO paint, December daily. There was something else. Oh! my studio organization. If you remember from my last 
vlog. My studio used to be over there. That's now the baby's area and our new couch. So we moved the studio into this corner and got some really cool um, like bookcase cube storage things from Target. New corner desk, which works out a lot better than the table I was using because I can actually use all of it. Um, so yeah, that's what's been going on. Let me give you a peek of what we've done so far with that. Turn it back up so you can see the whole thing. So that is the corner now. And yes, there's baby stuff everywhere. And then that is where the table used to be. And I actually have much better light because of the two windows there. So here is my desk, which is currently a mess because, like I said, I was playing with PBO paint. There's the desk. I've got, like, pens and pencils. The desktop isn't very organized yet, but there's photos in there, pens and pencils, things I'm currently using, pens. Those are my current layouts that I've been working on for my stash kit. That's still a little bit of the kit. And yeah, my paper trimmer down here are all my art journals that I've found so far, blank notebooks, computer stuff, some scrapbook paper, some scrapbooking supplies. This is all mini book and planner materials. And then in this one I've got my stamps here, my current papers and journals and art journals. This box, which has a lid, has all my paints, my sprays, anything that I didn't want my daughter to be able to get into. This one is all of my collage materials and that entire box is full. Don't tell Jamie. He doesn't realize that. This one is tissue paper and some stamps. Maybe my stamps are in there. That one must be my ink pads. So my stamps are all in here along with my punches. And then that is empty. Isn't that amazing? I have empty ones. And then in this one, In this one, I've got the Cameo, which I just got, photos, and then some paper. This is like my new paper and new products that I've gotten, and then these are um, packs, but I also think they're new. I think I put the other packs in the paper section. This is all the recycle, reuse, or art materials for projects with my daughter. Those are albums. That's my 2015 album. Sorry. That's my 2015 album. That is my childhood photo storage. So as I feel inspired to do something with my childhood, I just flip through the book and pick something. The new fuse tool and then page protectors. And then here I have embellishments, no matter what it is, letter stickers, sticker sheets, and then with that, anything I've found so far goes in there. And then this is all the paper I have found so far, including six by six paper pads and scraps. So that's what's going on with me today and I'm gonna go and get started before they wake up. So I'll talk to you guys later, bye.